Hello. What are you doing there? Oh, me? I'm just enjoying the Poe's many wonderful stories. I do love Poe. He's so dark and grotesque, and yet there just seems to be quite a beauty to it. What's that? Oh, you like more sex and gratuitous violence in your reading? Well, I must admit, I am a fan myself of sex and gratuitous violence. Well, if that's the sort of tale that you're up for, might I suggest a reading of my own work, though not on par with Poe, but filled with that sex and gratuitous violence that you seem to be so fond of. It is entitled Captive in the Dark, and it is by me, C.J. Roberts. Perhaps I will read you a little, and you can tell me whether or not it is the book for you. Now I'll warn you, this tale is full of dubious consent and violence and lots of colorful language. The word, the C word, the P word, pretty much all of the bad words. Shall we begin? The Prologue. Revenge, Caleb reminded himself. That was the purpose of all this. Revenge, 12 years in the planning and only a few months away in its execution. As a slave trainer, he had trained at least a score of girls. Some were willing, offering themselves as pleasure slaves to escape destitution, sacrificing freedom for security. Others came to him as the coerced daughters of impoverished farmers looking to offload their burden in exchange for a dowry. Some were the fourth or fifth wives of sheiks and bankers, sent by their husbands to learn to satisfy their distinct appetites. But this particular slave, the one he eyed from across the busy street, she was different. She, she was neither willing nor coerced nor sent to him. She was pure conquest. Caleb had tried to convince Rafiq he could train any one of the other types of girls, that they would best be prepared for such a serious, potentially dangerous task. But Rafiq would not be moved. He too had waited a long time to achieve his revenge, and he refused to leave anything to chance. The girl had to be someone truly Special. She had to be a gift so rare and valuable, she and her trainer alike would be talked about by everyone. After years of being the sole apprentice to Muhammad Rafiq, Caleb's reputation had slowly built, establishing him as a man both efficient and single-minded in whatever tasks were entrusted to him. He'd never failed, and now all those years had come to this moment. There was only one obstacle remaining between him and vengeance, the last true test of his soullessness, willfully stripping someone of their freedom. Draft, I'm afraid that's all we have time for today. This has been Captive in the Dark by me, C.J. Roberts, and exclusively read for Chapter One Live. If you would like to learn more about Captive in the Dark, part of the Dark Duet series, please follow me on Twitter at author CJ Roberts or like me on Facebook. You may also use the hashtag one click link at the bottom of this video for more on my books as well as others reading exclusively for Chapter One Live. Thank you for watching. Goodbye.
hard to say. In its execution. Tongue, the lips, the teeth, the tip of the tongue. The so hard, I hate everything! Shit. Husband's coming home.